Hi there. Today we are going to discuss very important and essential elements of our life. Power and purpose. In Hindi, if you may call it as Taqat. Taqat. Yeah, call it energy, whatever. Taqat. And Himmat. So I thought, uh, let me uh, uh, represent this in a, in a form of a matrix. X, Y, X, S. So Taqat versus Himmat. Right? अगर हमारे पास ताकत है तो क्या होगा हमारे पास हिम्मत है तो क्या होगा कम ज़्यादा है तो क्या होगा ताकत पावर सो अनदर एलिमेंट इज हिम्मत हिम्मत इफ आई मे कॉल इट एज पर्पज बिकॉज इफ योर पर्पज इज क्लियर दैन डेफिनेटली विल हैव लॉट ऑफ करेज करेज इज द बाई प्रोडक्ट ऑफ योर क्लैरिटी इन पर्पज लाइक ताकत राइट So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is a matrix. As I was talking about, himmat versus taqat, yeah, purpose versus power, x-axis, y-axis. So, power is there. You will see on y-axis, and purpose you will see in x-axis. Taqat or himmat. First quadrant. If you closely uh, take a look at all the quadrants, the first quadrant. Let's focus on the first quadrant. First quadrant is all about. when we have less power minimal power and minimal purpose this basically courage what happens we won't be able to do we won't be able to achieve anything in life could be personal life or professional life hum kuch nahi kar payenge na hamare paas taakat hai na hamare paas himmat okay second quadrant second quadrant is when we have enough power hamare paas taakat bahut zyada hai लेकिन हिम्मत कम है वॉट विल हैपन इन दिस सिचुएशन वॉट इज द फ्लिप साइड एंड वॉट इज द गुड साइड ऑफ इट कि हमारे पास में ताकत बहुत है लेकिन हिम्मत बहुत कम है भाई क्यों क्यों ऐसा होता है वाई इट हैपन्स बिकॉज ऑफ सर्टन पास्ट एक्सपीरियंसिस ऑफ फेलियर ऑफ फेलियर्स कुड बी एनी थिंग इन एनी फील्ड सो वी वी आर नॉट एबल टू टेक इनफ रिस्क because we have failed right so we worry and we have many excuses many reasons family is there career is there you know this and that okay so we think twice we think many many times before doing uh, anything in life before taking decision in life so this is what it has good effect because many times we don't invite unnecessary problems to us but many times we lose out on great opportunities in life because we won't be able to take quick decisions yeah we think a lot and many times too much of thinking too much of analysis is like a paralysis okay so there is lot of power but no or minimal purpose no clarity and purpose it is a state of confusion it's a it's a state of fear okay now the third the whole idea is basically to move into the third quadrant the sweet quadrant the most desirable quadrant that basically we have when you have enough strength that's power and absolute clarity on purpose himmat bhi hai aur taqat bhi hai to fir aap yahan pe kuch bhi hasil kar sakte hain koi aapko rok nahi sakta hai aapki niji zindagi ho ya aapka kaam kaaj so now third quadrant we were talking about where you have the guts you have enough guts to take calculated risks and you have power also power not necessary you know uh, your physical strength it comes from the clarity it could be spiritual strength because of the clarity of purpose is absolute over here it could be technology it could be you know any materialistic strength it could be manpower it could be good infrastructure it could be good qualification it could be fantastic experience this is all about your taqat it's all about your power and purpose your highest possible purpose very good peace of mind right so that is basically about this quadrant third quadrant the most important quadrant the quadrant of success ah uh, you have enough power you have enough purpose bahut taqat hai bahut himmat hai koi bhi aapko rok nahi sakta hai right <laughs> calculated risks and risk hai to ishq hai ishq hai to risk hai now the fourth quadrant ladies and gentlemen boys and girls 
Now this quadrant is, you can take a look, this quadrant is all about what? You have enough of himmat, lekin taqat kam hai. Purpose clear hai, but there is less power. So what to do now? Which kind of state is this? When you have lot of purpose, but no power. This happens usually when we are young, right? Hormonal changes, being hot-blooded, yeah? So, some bursts of, you know, taqat, of power we have experienced, but that is not enough. But because of which, you know, we got some, some courage. So, here, people take blind risks. And what is the flip side? Many times, we invite problems for us. Problems for self, problems for families, many times problems for organization we work in our early young days. Okay, the, f- the good side is many times you may land up you now uh, from here into the third quadrant, and uh, because you learn from the failure, slowly you get into the function also. But the flip side is you can get into the second quadrant. That if you have bad experiences, bitter experience, fearful experiences, and many times your confidence goes on a toss. So you have to be very very careful. You have to gather enough, enough power. That power, as I explained earlier, it could be in any form, not just physical. It could be any form. So when you have enough power, enough purpose, yeah, enough thakat, enough himmat, then you will get into the third quadrant. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, if I may define in my way this equation, success is equal to constant variable is a function of P1 and P2. P1 is nothing but your power and P2 is nothing but your purpose, your taqat and your himmat. Success. Any project, it could be short term project, long term project in personal life and professional life. So it's very, very simple, you know. What I mean by constant, see constant here is experience. Even when you are not doing anything, you are going to have certain experience. Whatever you do, you have certain experience. Even not doing is kind of an experience. Yeah. But what do we learn? The variable is basically learning. The degree of learning. With every experience, if you learn more, yeah, when the learning is enhanced, when the learning is maximum, okay, then you, you can have better purpose, you can have better power. Yeah. <laughs> you, you know the purpose of power, you know the power, how it complement purpose yeah, and the sources of powers also. And how learning comes? Learning comes by being awake, by being conscious, by being fantastic holistic observer in life. So to summarize, success is equal to, now success is very relative ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. You define as what you, you know, it could be peace of mind, it could be assimilation of some knowledge, it could be acquiring some position, it could be anything. Yeah, But you need to Keep in mind that you will be always exposed to something in this world. So you are going to have experience. But what you learn from that experience, that matters. How much you learn from that experience, it matters. And how you have clarity on purpose and you gather power. That Because earlier we have, we have discussed that power and position are very important element and that contribute to success. Thank you ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. You may have your own versions when it comes to power and purpose and success. Thank you very much. Let's keep exploring, keep, keep co-evolving. Thank you.